Hey guys, welcome back to Web Mentors YouTube channel and you're watching JavaScript series for beginners. Well, till the last video, the previous video, we haven't seen much about JavaScript. Let's actually start doing something in JavaScript, but before that, I need to show you something which we'll be using in order to see results from the JavaScript. So, the first thing is going to be creating a script tag. So, this is a very important tag for JavaScript. So, if you want to add something, you know, some JavaScript to a HTML file, then you have to use this tag. In case if you're using, you know, it's called as adding a script to a web page, but there's three different ways you can add JavaScript to a web page. So, I will be covering that in the next, you know, upcoming videos. But this is something that I have to show you before going on to writing various JavaScripts in order to show you the results. Now, what I'm going to cover right now is going to be alert function in JavaScript, so which you might already know that because the title of the video is already written like that. So, alert function, this is the function. So, this is a simple function which doesn't have. So, if you want any kind of message to be displayed, all you have to do is that write them inside. So, this is a alert message. Now, once I save it and refresh or reload the page, you will be getting an alert message which you might have already seen from various websites which given you some alert messages like Google also does that, Gmail also does it. So, let's actually refresh this page. And you can see that an alert message came. So, this is an alert message. So, this is the actual message that we have written inside the alert function and you can see that my page is still loading. It's not loaded yet. Now, this is not a bug or else an issue, but this is how it works. So, once you press OK, you can see that my page finished loading. Now, this is the problem that happens when you write a JavaScript like this. So, there is one way to actually make this you know, loading to be completed first and then the alert message to be called which is called as wait till the document finished loading. But we're not going to see that in this video because this is just a small video explaining you what an alert message will do. An alert message will create an alert pop-up for your browser. It doesn't matter which browser you use, it will create a pop-up and it will display the message that you write inside the alert message function. Now, there are a few functions that you can do along with the alert message, but we're not going to cover that in this particular video. This alert function is just to give you an introduction about alert function yeah, in order to make sure that upcoming videos will be having some alert function which will display the results that we are going to get from the JavaScript that we are writing. So, just keep this in mind. Don't expect too much from this particular video. Just a small thing because I thought of writing the JavaScript, but how to display them? Now, the best way to do that is the alert message. So, there is another thing which we'll be covering later on, which is actually what the developers do these days instead of the alert message. So, let's see them in the later videos. So, thank you for watching this video, guys. And uh, if you find this video useful, please hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it already. And also, share the video with your friends or anyone you think will be benefited by this video. And if you have any comments, issues, suggestions, or feedbacks, please leave them in the comment section. Or you can contact me through the Facebook page, Google Plus page, or else do a feed. And you can find the links for them in the description section. Well, thank you for watching. Let's see you in the next video. Keep watching the series.